Sobonana to complete the lineup at the 1400 meter mark. A big money here on offer, two and a half million rand. Ready and away in racing. Got them away to a good start. Duke Newcomb was quickly away. Racing up there, Khaleesi, main submission in top form, a wider out, Champagne Hayes, races three and a half, four lengths off them. Then came off to goal, the badges on the outside, Beige and Fantasy, Rabada is racing a bit wide in the early stages, got seven lengths to make up, King of Chaos behind that. Then Terra Pova, heaps of fun, further back into Galactic, Monarch Air and Witchcraft and Sobonana is the trailer, there's 15 lengths first to last, they're going a really strong gallop here, 800 metres to go. Top form is in front, brings them in by a good three lengths here. Khaleesi second, Duke Newcomb in main submission, then Champagne Hayes five to go. Rabada's moving closer, got six minutes to make up. Further to the inside, off to goal, King of Chaos. Then came heaps of fun. The badge in behind that as they come down with 450 to go. Top form clear by two. Champagne Hayes coming home quickly. Main submission. Duke Newcomb, Rabada still got four lengths to make up. Khaleesi behind that. Champagne Hayes hits the front in the CTS Empress Palace, ready to run cup. And it's Champagne Hayes. Duke Newcomb is back in second. Rabada is on the outside. Champagne Hayes is clear though of Rabada and Champagne Hayes will win it easily. Second to Rabada, King of Chaos, a blinder third. Then Duke Newcomb, heaps of fun, main submission, Khaleesi, Terra Pova into Galactic, further back top form, off to Gore, Monarch Air ran behind that, further back in the field was behind that Bajan Fantasy and the badge crossed the line at the tail end. Well, Rabada came to the extreme outside of the track and Andrew Fortune down the inside gives a big wave across to his mate Anton Marcus. Watch the finish here. He's clear. He looks where Rabada is. He's got a good eye on Rabada on the stand side and very cheekily in the finish, he waves goodbye to Anton Marcus and wins it on Champagne Hayes. What a win for Gary Alexander, Jared and Lawrence Werners, Pravin Chetty, Bruce Gardner, Adrian Giritic, Mr. Labuschagne, Greg Sadie, Simpson, and Mrs. Gardner and Witcher. Second to Rabada by four. Third, King of Chaos. Fourth place will go to Duke Newcomb. And further back in the field was heaps of fun. Well, it's a fantastic win for the son of Kahal. He's related to that top horse, Pierre Jordan. And he has come through with flying colors. He was close to the pace. Rabada tends to hang out in the finish. Anton Marcus. Tried to get him over from a very bad draw. Didn't really manage to. They'll finish on the stand side, but Champagne Hayes was too good for him today. Rabada tastes defeat for the first time. Third placing will go to King of Chaos. And fourth in the terrific race for the Alexander Stable goes to Duke Newcomb. They've run first, third, and fourth. And a terrific day for the Gary Alexander Racing Stables. Well done to Champagne Hayes, the winner of the CTS Empress Palace, ready to run cup. Well, it is number four, Champagne Hayes, that wins here. Molly for Andrew Fortune, Gary Alexander, Mr. Vernon's, Previn Chetty, Gardner, Golrick, Labaskakni, plenty of owners here. The half brother of uh, Pierre Jordan has proved just how good he is. Yeah, and don't you just love Andy Fortune's wave at Anton across yep. the course uh, saying hello, sunshine? Typical Andrew. Yeah, yeah, there <laughs> you are. You've run second. I'm too good for you today. <laughs> Absolutely too good. So it's four from one from three and eight, but it's all number four, Champagne Hayes. He'll be picking up a cool 1.25 million rand. And returning to the winner's enclosure for the CTS Empress Palace, ready to run cup. Winning three out of his five races to date is number four, Champagne Hayes. Congratulations go to the Gary Alexander Racing Stable. Three-year-old Bay Colt by Cahal out of the key. Danzig Mayor Vin Fizz was bred by Mickey Goss and the Summerhill stud. Well done to Mick Goss and his team from Moy River. The winning owners, and there are a lot of them. Messrs. Jared and Lawrence Werners. Lawrence not here today. He's attending the Rugby World Cup final.
but his wife Tessa is, and well done to her, to Mr. Pravin Chetty, to Bruce Gardner, Bruce and Joe Gardner, to Adrian Giricic, Mr. Jay Labuskakny, Greg Sadie, Daryl Simpson, and Mrs. Joe Gardner and AP Witcher. A lot of owners celebrating that win of Champagne Hayes, taking home a prize of one and a quarter million rand for its win today by three lengths. Second to number one, Rabada. Third was number three, King of Chaos. Fourth to number eight, Duke Nukem. And fifth was number 13, Heaps of Fun. Well, a very nice win from number four, Champagne Hayes. He's a three-year-old son of Cahal. He's a half-brother to Pierre Jordan. He was trained by Gary Alexander. So, too, was Pierre Jordan. So, it's a bit of a family affair here. And new to the family, for this season anyway, Andrew, well done. Thank you, Grant. Thank you. Oh, you know what? It just, I haven't slept. I never slept last night. I raced, and I never rode a winner yesterday. And I said to everybody in the jockey room, it doesn't count. Because tomorrow I'll win the two and a half million and race anyway. And oh, listen to me, it just... It's such a great team effort. I want to get emotional when I talk about it, you know. When I got up here and think it's gone so well, and uh, I found a big horse again. And that, that is such a great thing. And Gary has found a big horse again. And it's just a great team. It's just a pleasure working for them. And uh, running to the 400, I had so much horse. And I, and I was looking for a border, and I'm thinking, fuck, I don't want to go yet, you know. Uh, and at the 300, I said, no, fuck that, I'm out of here. <laughs> and, and, and listen to me. That's how, I thought, that's how good I thought he was. You know, I sprinted him up on Thursday. And I said to Gary, uh, I just, just can't lose. He, he can't lose on his work. We worked him with that filly. I just got beat in the thing. And, and he's just so much better than her. But listen to me, there's so many owners. I just want to be, I'm, I'm grateful that they uh, like, uh, want me to ride for them and Gary. And uh, just a great team effort. And I'm so grateful to be part of it. Well, don't run away because there's a couple of things. Bob Buren from Empress Palace has got your shield as well as another gift as well. I want to ask you one last question. Yeah. That little turn and look that you gave Anton Marcus, what were you actually thinking to yourself there? Ah, uh, God, let me rather keep that to myself. <laughs> <laughs> Andrew Fortune, always a pleasure to stand and get a couple of pictures taken. And then we're going to call in trainer Gary Alexander. Now, Gary Alexander, it's a bit of a family reunion because obviously Pierre Jordan did so much for your stable. This fella's now come and uh, judging by what Andrew's got to say, he's going to be just as exciting. Well, let's hope so. Um, you know, at the sales, I, I really like the sauce and I'm not one for buying brothers, especially the, the, the freaks in when you get them, the Ruby Clippers, the Pierre Jordans, James Jackson, those type horses. So I'm not one to go, but when I saw the sauce, I really, he, he got my eye and I, I put 500,000. Now that I can tell Mickey, that's what I had for him. And we got him at 280, so I'm really thrilled that he can run. And uh, I mean, what a team effort. I've got so many people to thank, but they know that I'm, I'm trying my best. And I tell you what, if I can just keep on buying the horses that I really want to buy, I think this table will go a long way. Well, I'm going to ask you now, because you've got a massive syndicate and all your closest guys that have been with the stable for a long time, that it must be really nice and fulfilling to have them part of this. Of course. I mean, it's fantastic. I've, had, I've got owners over here that have supported me and re some really bad times that we've had and the stable has been struggling a little bit. But you know what? They're here and they're still here and that's, you've got to thank God for that. There's another relationship that you've had that's been really solid all the way through and that's your relationship with Mick and Summerhill. And it must be great to have another big victory with him as you're part of the team as well. Of course. I mean, uh, Mickey Goss, uh, he's bred lots of good horses. And uh, one thing about Mickey, when you buy a horse off his farm, you know you're going to get a nice athlete. Gary, you must be over the moon. I'm sure all these guys are looking forward to getting their trophy as well. But another good mate of yours, Bob Urim, is going to present you with the winning shield. Of course. Thanks. Well done, Gary, all the best, yeah. Fantastic stuff. Another photo opportunity. <laughs> Very popular winner here. Gary Alexander and his full team. Right, who's going to represent the owners? We're going to get some of the owners coming through. Tessa, oh, there we go. 
Right, we've got a, a bit of a reluctance, speaker, but I'll start with Bruce because you've never been reluctant, especially when you won a big race. Well, I haven't won many big races, Grant, to be fair, but uh, to Tess, um, we've, we've, as all the owners got together, we said we're going to give Lawrence a first-class ticket anywhere in the world every time this horse runs. Because... <laughs> He's a good charm to be away, but good luck to Lawrence. They, they took the lion's share, and then we all filled up. Uh, Gary's married to the family, and it's just been a lovely ride. Mark Khan, you're a superstar. Uh, Andrew, had all of, he, he said this is better than the brother. I, you know, I don't always believe that, because I, I remember I flew in a plane once, and, and uh, Jaffe's assistant said to me, do you ever remember Napoleon's brother? <laughs> But this looks like it could be a dream come true. But to Tess and, and, and Lawrence and uh, Mick and the team, I mean, he's still got a lot of growing to do. He, uh, he's quite immature. So I, th I think there's lots to look forward to. Tess, must be really exciting. Yeah, very exciting. Just um, sad that Lawrence couldn't be here. But, um, yeah, happy the, for everybody else that, that actually won, so it's great. Well, a nice big crew that you've got here as well. I'm sure you're all going to enjoy the moment as well. It's a, you know, racing with a team is what it's about, you know. Rugby's got 15 and 7 on the bench. We, we're about there. <laughs> Fantastic. Let's ask Bob to hand you. Don't run away, Bruce. You've got photographs and a trophy. And uh, Tess is going to take the trophy. There we go. Congratulations, guys. To all the owners, well done. Not all of you got a chance to chat here, but congratulations. Brilliant stuff. Well done. Now, we're gonna have, we'll have another photo opportunity soon. We've still got a couple of trophies to present as well in the Groom's Prize. But uh, let's have a quick photograph. All right, now I'm going to ask Bob if you can please get the other shield ready. I'm going to call Mick Goss forward. Mick, if you want to come join us. You're the vendor. You obviously know this family well. You actually gave Craig Carey a big hug because I think that's who you acquired the mayor from originally. Stole it. Six, 60,000 with a folded foot. Uh, but Craig designed the mating for, for Pierre Jordan. So this is a bit of a family thing with CTS involvement and everything else. Um, to Bobby, our old mate, the guys at Emperors, uh, this is a very emotional relationship. It's an old one. It means an awful lot to us. Uh, but to the Alexander Stable, they run first, third and fourth today. It's a remarkable achievement. And to everybody associated with this sale, um, CTS who've done an incredible job for us, uh, to, to the people out there who've supported us every year, to all the owners that got so much pleasure out of this in the ring today, big thank you. And it's, a, it's wonderful to be associated with a race like this. I think we run the first five. I couldn't count after that. Uh, but anyway, it was a big day for them as well. Thank you. Brilliant to have you here. Bob, your mate's going to give you your trophy as well as the vendor. Mickey Goss gets his trophy from uh, a very, very nice winner there, Champagne Hayes. Right, we've given Gary the groom's prize. Your Gary is your groom here, is he left as well? Okay, fantastic. But uh, a very nice win there. And uh, Gary will take the groom's prize back with him as well. Champagne wins it. Congratulations to all the connections here. Dean Alexander as well. I've never seen him smiling this big. 